Hi, in this video we will install everything that is needed to start React Native development at OS X. Let's review the tools that we will need. Homebrew is an OS X tool used to install external dependencies. We are going to use it to install Node. Node is used to run JavaScript code without a browser. It is used to process JavaScript source files and run tests. Yarn is a node package manager. It replaces npm, the standard package manager that comes with node. While it is not required, it is supported by React Native and I highly recommend it as a much faster and more predictable alternative to npm. Watchman is a tool that monitors your files for changes so that it can rebuild and reload your app as you developed it. Create React Native app is a command line tool we will use to generate our apps. Now the Xcode. Xcode is Apple's integrated development environment for building software. You need it to build an app and publish it in the App Store. It also comes with an iOS simulator that you can use to test the app on a local machine. So let's start with Homebrew installation. I navigate to Homebrew home page at brew.sh and now you can locate the command used to install it. Let's copy it and paste in the command line window. Okay, I need to type root password and now the installation is starting. It takes a couple of minutes, so let's just rewind. Okay, it seems we are good now, so let's start with installing Node. Okay, and now Watchman. And Yarn. Now we are ready to install Create React Native App. We use it with npm install minus g command that installs Create React Native App globally. Okay, it seems we are good here as well. So now let's verify our Xcode installation. So we need to search for Xcode in App Store. Okay, I have Xcode already installed, but uh, we need to verify that it is the latest version as you may get some unpredictable errors if your Xcode version is not up to date. But here it looks fine, so we are ready to implement our first React Native app. 